What's up, everybody? Now, I said that was my last video for the day, but I'm going to go for the four-piece because this match was a really, really good match, and this guy um, wasn't a dick or anything about it. It's just the way Yu-Gi-Oh! goes, and it was just a crazy match. I mean, it, it really was. This was a phenomenal, crazy match right here. So if y'all are ready to watch a crazy-ass match, strap in, get some popcorn, get whatever you get when you watch my videos, and check this shit out, because this shit was epic. All right, he's playing like a Go Control type deck. I'm playing my regular Chaos Turbo that I've been playing, but just the amount of plays and mind thought i mean my head is hurting so bad from every kind of like nip and like every every decision had to be the right decision for me to come up like i did but anyways let's see he's got he gets to go first he's got regeki break sukiyomi snatch duo faith and chaos sorcerer i got graceful knock sinister solemn and knock double knock here he decides to set fate and set Regeki break and say go. Okay, and why he wouldn't do a first turn is kind of crazy, but I mean, it was a good play because I had the Sinister, so it was a pretty good play. So I discard Sinister and upstart. I instantly knock the face down. Oh, he was, he was going for the double, double duo play. That's what it was. That's why he did that. So you're already getting sick plays here. Sickness. So I knock him instantly. I set Wing Blast, set Solemn, set Jar Greed, and set Nobleman Across Out, and say go. He draws into his Graceful, which is pretty clutch here, not gonna lie. That's a clutch draw for him. Alright, he fires the Graceful. I probably could have um, Solemn that, but I'm glad I didn't, and Thunder Dragon was right on top. So he could have big brain more and just waited for the Graceful, because there's no point to even play it right there. But it's all right, though. The dude was cool. So he pot of greeds. He's just got every kind of everything. I mean, I got nothing going this game. So he draws Snatch Deal and um, Knock and just says go. I draw Torrential. I get my Sinister back here. I draw a Greed. He says okay. I draw into Ring. Um, and I set Torrential and just pass. He draws Book of Moon. He snap sets the Book of Moon. I draw Wing Blast. I set the ring and say go which was a good set here because i get to pop him pop his breaker versus wasting, wasting my tarantula so i'm glad i set that right there so he summons the breaker i instantly ring it and that's it for that turn i draw on the duo i instantly fire the duo because i'm like fuck it might as well just go for it of course i hit the thunder dragon and no shit and i just say go he draws in the meta he says go i draw on the spy now, I probably am sure he's got knocks and shit, so I'm just going to run the spy out. I don't set it or anything because it's been so long this game already. So I poke into him. He flips up his um, scapegoat, which is fine. He scapegoats me, okay? He draws into Kaiku, all right? And you see how these games are going right now. I mean, when you got two people that know what they're doing, this is what happens. So I instantly um, put the Kaiku back on top and set him back a turn. Get my sinister back switch my spy set another wing blast and say go he instantly tries the meta which is going to be met with my wing blast put that back on top i'm fighting like crazy here and he runs out the chaos sorcerer here which i let that go which is fine I'm trying to get him to summon that kaiku but he doesn't do it he's smart see he's too smart so i get my sinister back now I know he has knock, so I'm trying to get him to waste the knock here, so I set the spy. And he does knock right away, which is what I wanted him to do. And he switches his Chaos Sorcerer and pokes me for 23. I take it. I draw Pot of Greed, which is a good draw. I draw Chaos Sorcerer and Jar Greed. I run out the Breaker. He is going to poke a Moon on Summon, which is fine. I set Jar Greed and pass. He draws Chaos Sorcerer. He draws BLS and Chaos Sorcerer. It's crazy. And he pokes over my monster and says, go. Uh, I think about it. I draw a greed here. He's going to chain Rick. Oh, he thought it was the Kree there. That's what happened there. He thought that was the Kree. So now I know he has Regeki break, which is fine. This is going to be a long match, y'all. This is a long thought process type shit here. So I hit him and I knock him main phase two and say, go. He runs with the Kaiku. This, that's where I misplayed this game. I should have never ever tarantula right there when he summoned that because i had the sukiyomi for it he didn't have game anyways 
I got to really think about when I fire Tarantula because that was obviously a terrible misplay there. So that did cost me the game, that Tarantula right there, because he's got both darks, both lights, drops them both and crushes me game one because I Tarantula. All I had to do was just wait to see, but he might not have summoned it. He might have just attacked into it. Then I could have just summoned Yomi and ran over it and he would have regeki braked or whatever. So it probably was the same concept anyways. But I was game one, he got me. GG. Um, yeah, I shouldn't have Tarantula there. So that was a misplay. I will admit that I did do a misplay there. It sucks. But we're going on to game two here. I board into Trap Dust Shoots, Kaikus, and Mind Controls. All right, he's got Sinister, Double Decree, Breaker, and Thunder Dragon. I got Thunder Dragon, Sangin, MST, Mind Control. I got Double Thunder Dragon. Yeah, I opened Double Thunder Dragon. So I decide to set MST and set Sangin and say go. He draws into Tsukiyomi. He discards his Thunder Dragon because he doesn't have two. He has only one, of course. And he runs up the Breaker and pops my back row hits my sangin i go grab sinister he sets his decree and says go oh shit let's slow down now all right i put his breaker face down and run into it and just say go he draws into a regeki break all right and he just says go i draw a chaos sorcerer here i run the chaos sorcerer out and say fuck it let's go for some damage here and poke him for 23. He's going to take it. All he has is Decree. He takes the 23. And I just set one and pass. He draws into another Regeki Break, which is great. Summons a Tsukiyomi, sets a face down, attacks the face down monster. And I thought he had Knock, but nope, he doesn't have Knock. So he says, no, he's he's not that good, he said. So it's just a crazy match, y'all. I mean... Every at every point in this game, I, I didn't think my game. I fucked up game one by torrential, and maybe I would have had him that game. Probably not. So, standby phase. I go get my sinister back. Okay, I decide to flip the chaos sorcerer. He says okay. I run the battle phase, and that's gonna be met with a regeki break, of course. I set Jar Agreed and set Sinister. He end phase Decrees. This is what really sucks when he decrees me here. Because now it's like, fuck, I hate Decree. I really hate that card. That's one of my most hated cards. That and all the Panda Burn shit are my two, like, fuck off cards. It just sucks. I was really discouraged right here. So, he gets his Sinister back. And misclick the set, which is fine. And he just ends and send, discards a Sinister. All right, and then I'm gonna I decide to go for some damage here. Hit him for 16 again, bringing him down to 41. He draws into a clutch ass card, Graceful Charity, which fucking sucks. And he graceful. He draws Chaos Sorcerer, Heavy Storm, and Scapegoat. Pretty good draws there, to say the least. So let's see what he's gonna do now. He decides to banish a Dark and Light, which he thought it was Sinister, but it wasn't. He thought the Dark was Sinister and sets one and just says go. Okay, now let's see what I can do here. Alright, standby phase, I get the Sinister. And now it's my turn to use Graceful Charity. This was a big turning point in this game right here, drawing that Graceful. That was really good. So I Graceful, I'm trying to get a kill shot here. But let's see, I draw into Pot, Knock, and Spy. I discard the Thunder Dragon and the Sinister. I Pot Agreed into Nobleman and Heavy Storm. I Mind Control the Face Down, hoping it's a Faith, which it is. So I get the Faith, I draw. I mean, there's no way that I thought I could come back this game, but uh, I just did. So there's three trap cards I drew, which sucks. So now I have to think about what I'm discarding. Discard a Nobleman and a Spy. I heavy storm to get the decree out of here. I run out the Tsukiyomi, knock it, and attack him for 1100. And I set four cards and say go, bring him back to Tsukiyomi. And bring him back to the Majors of Faith and send the Tsukiyomi back to my hand. Now, he's obviously going to fire the. Oh no, he tries to summon first and I instantly torrential. So why he didn't heavy first is kind of um, crazy, but. He decides to keep the Heavy Storm, which is crazy. And he sets Road Decree. Nope, he thinks about it. 
He's trying to run off Spirit Reaper when he already summoned Tsukiyomi, so that's not happening. He tries the heavy. I have to um, solemn it. So it puts me at 4,000. He sets a decree, sets a scapegoat, sets a rejecty break, and says go. I get the sinister back. Now, this is where I misplay as well. I should have definitely set sinister here. I should have. Instead, I got greedy and I set the damn faith, which really fucked me up here. So I set the faith, set mirror force. He in phase. Uh, Regeki break pops it. Which sucks. He didn't decree though, which is um, okay, I guess. And Sinister goes back to his hand. He runs out this uh, Spare Reaper, which I say okay. He hits me, which I'm glad. I took the 300 here. And I'm just thinking, don't hit the Yomi. And he does not hit the Yomi. So I get Sinister back. I draw. And now my dumbass sets a sinister when i should have just fucking set the damn fucking fate this time so it's just all like fucking mind mind games is all this game is it's all fucking mind games so this time i set the sinister and long behold he runs into it he decides to attack it so if i would have just set the fate it would have been good but it's all good so now he decides to set his faith okay i'm gonna draw here i draw into spy which is pretty bad not gonna lie but I have a mind control set here. So I get my sinister back. I decide to fire the wing blast. He decrees, which fucking sucks. So he says cost, which is my cost, which is sinister. I grab my sinister back here. And I decide to mind control the face down, which is faith, which is good, which is clutch. So if I go get my Graceful Charity, draw me some more cards, I draw Chaos Sorcerer, Ring, and Trap Does You. Now Ring, I think it's gonna come up and, and win, but I just don't know when. So now I decide to discard the Sinister and discard the Trap Does You, because those two are pretty dead. I decide to run out the Chaos Sorcerer and poke his ass for 2,000. So leaving him at 1,000. Okay, main phase two, I decide to run out Tsukiyomi and set my chaos sorcerer and just say go and say if you got it you got it so he draws book of moon which is a pretty good draw for him because now he can um book of moon the faith flip it up and get graceful charity he forgot his sinister oh no he didn't he got it. he has a sinister in hand uh okay so he can now he flips it up gets the graceful which is fine. He graceful charities. See what he draws here. My life points are pretty low. 3,700. He draws Kaiku, Sangin, and Didi Warrior Lady. Which are pretty dead draws right now. So he decides to metamorphosis the... The, um... Faith. And get his Thousand Eyes restrict out. It's just a long fucking game. Um... And he decides to set his Sangin and say go. I draw in the Book of Moon. Now, at this point, I'm thinking I can I can game shot his ass. I just got to think about how I'm going to do it. So, the first thing to do is I set the spy as the bluff. So, maybe he'll nobleman or something. He draws Snatch Steel. He can't really do much here. So, he just says go. I set the fate, and I'm thinking I'm going for it next turn if he ain't got it. Just one more turn. I'm not having anything. Which he draws Kaiku, which is clutch. Then I draw the BL motherfucking S. Let's fucking go. Black Luster. So now I'm going balls to the wall. I flip the um, Thousand Eyes trick down. I flip up the Faith. Go get the MST. MST that fucking... Or no, Heavy Storm. I go get Heavy Storm. Just get all that shit out of here. Heavy Storm. I don't even book a moon, my Faith. Because I'm like, fuck it. I don't even need to. Banish, banish. Run this shit out. Banish the face down. Poke into the Thousand Eyes. Set Trap Dust Shoot. Set Ring. Instantly in draw phase, I'm like, if you ain't got Book of Moon, we're going to game three, motherfucker. Let's see it. Boom. Trap does shoot, and I'm so happy because I ring a destruction my own monster, and it is fucking game. Let's go. How in the hell I came back there? Have no idea. Did some crazy-ass plays. Any Yu-Gi-Oh player that, that plays Go Format knows that you just gotta, you gotta know how to fucking work with it. Take the blows. Take the L's when you, you know what I'm saying? And just... Just get in there, but I got in there, all right? So now, we're on to game three here, okay? I'm saying I can't believe I came back. I have no idea how I fucking even won that game. I still, my head's still hurting from playing that game because it was just so much thought process. 
All right, so I open Ring, MST, Fate, Wing Blast, and Knock. He's got DD Warrior Lady, Heavy, Knock, BLS, Kaiku, and draw Sinister for turn. He decides to set DD Warrior Lady and set Heavy Storm. He's going for a Pro Storm here. I draw the clutchest card I could have drawn right there, which was Breaker, the Magical Warrior, because I run out the Breaker, run the Breaker out, pop the back row, which is clutch, no mana cross out, now I know Heavy Storm's gone, so I instantly set my entire hand and just say go. He draws in a Decree. All right, so he's going to set the cross out, set the Sinister, and set the Decree. Now, why I don't end phase MST here is because I'm waiting for the crop for the um decree. So I instantly bait him here. I instantly go for the wing blast to target the monster. And I pitch my deco. He tries to decree and I got the MST. Boom. Get that shit out of here. Blow him out. Put it on top. Hit his ass for 1600. Set my faith and say go. He runs out his kaiku, which is fine. And I got the ring for his ass. Boom, ring. So the life points are going down. He's at 3,000. I'm at 662. That's the first damage. Main phase two, he noble mends the faith, which sucks. Not going to lie. That's really bad. I draw on the Thunder Dragon. Any monster I would have won, but instead it's a fucking Thunder Dragon, which sucks. So I hit him for 16. Puts him down to 1,400 now. And I go get my Thunder Dragons. The the deck out he draws graceful charity must be fucking nice jesus christ two chaos sorcerers and a tribe he decides to throw out the bls and the sinister and he's going to get a little aggressive here and he tries to put it in defense but no he changes his mind puts an attack i'm like all right you've been cool anyways no problem not gonna do anything like that i usually don't do any type of shit like that i know if it's a misclick you want to change your mind that's fine so I draw on the spy. Game is not looking too good for me. He draws in the pot of greed. So he just drew Grace Wolf. Now he drew pot of greed. So it's like holy fucking shit. I'm like, damn, top deck fucking of the world. And he even says, feel like Yugi. So he draws in the Reaper and Soul Release, which isn't really doing much for him right now. So I go get my spy. He can't do anything. He can't pop the spy right now because it pops his chaos sorcerer. So main phase two, he decides to set Reaper and say go. I run out the good old Mobius. I'm like, fuck it. I got to go for it now. That was a good draw because I can instantly hit over the Chaos Sorcerer. And if he wants to get rid of it, he's got to get rid of his spy as well. So he draws Trap Death Shoot, which is a dead draw, which is awesome. That's a brick. Just keep drawing bricks. He decides to... Tribe, which pops that as well. He doesn't want to flip the Reaper because he knows he'll die. So I YOLO a Mind Controller, which was a misplay. Not going to lie because it hasn't done anything for turn. So obviously it's nothing. It's obviously a Reaper or something like that. But he draws into Mind Control. Okay. And he switches the Reaper to defense. And he soul releases. Banishes five out of my graveyard. Which sucks. All my darks, all my lights. And I draw and say it's my turn to top deck. Graceful motherfucking charity. Let's go. I draw into Mind Control, Solemn Judgment, and Mirror Force. I discard both Thunder Dragons. I set all three and pray to God he ain't got Decree. <laughs> set all three and pray no Decree. And I just say go here. And he draws another Trap Dust Suit. He's bricked up from the dick up. Holy shit. And here we go. He's at 1300. My turn. I draw Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer, and it's Celebration Pop Bottles. Holy shit, Mind Control the Spirit Reaper. Run out the fucking Kaiku with the Decree set. Let's fucking go. Swing for game. Woo, woo. Damn, what a fucking match. That was the longest match I have on my channel. 20-minute video. That was the longest match I played in a while. He beat me game one. I came back, played both of them games so fucking good so great i mean he did fucking draw like shit not gonna lie so that did help the cause but i i fucking i put the fucking work in my head's hurting from it so hit the like hit the sub um this is the fourth video for the day and this will be the final one for sure hope everyone has a good day or night um i'll see y'all gfc 17 this weekend 
Make sure to um come in there and I don't know, say something to me. Maybe I'll get a fucking a duel on the TV or some shit. Maybe I'll get a feature match, they call it, whatever the fuck. If not, it's all right. But man, what a fucking match, y'all. Peace out. Master Reactor out. Bye.